Is that me? I think it is. Going to the Target. What? I know it's so weird. We never go to Target ever. And then I think, you know how dryers have sock, like sock stealers? <laughs> I think my car has a fuel stealer. Because it seems like every time we get in it, it's out of gas. Anybody else have that problem? We're going to Target. We're going to get some of our groceries that aren't on sale at the local at the local Publix. And we may look at some Halloween decorations. But it's another fall day here in Alabama. It's yeah. kind of cool and dreary. And it's cooler than it was yesterday. Even. Yeah, yeah. But guess what? I still love fall. So <laughs> bring it on. <laughs> I'm actually wearing a, a hoodie. We kind of match. We're both wearing black hooded sweatshirts. So we kind of match or we kind of look like we're about to knock off the local bank or something. <laughs> Hi guys. Hello. Happy Saturday. Happy Saturday. Um, I know we told you last night we were going to Target to get some Halloween decorations and by some we got one. So <laughs> this is what we got. We have it outside of our apartment. We don't really know how long it will remain there until someone <laughs> steals it from us, but we thought we'd show you pretty quick before. So, that's, that's our Halloween haul. Happy Halloween! <laughs> <laughs> but we are off. It's rainy and gross out there. You can't really see. But, um, look out there. Oh, it's so yucky out today. It's not the fun kind of fall day that we like. It's yeah. the gross kind of fall day. But, so we got a couple things to accomplish and you guys are gonna come with us. See you soon. Hi guys. Hello. We just got done at Best Buy. And we have, we are like glutton, gluttons for punishment, I think. Yeah, whenever we go into that particular Best Buy, I'm reminded why, why we, we don't, don't go to that Best Buy. Particular Best Buy, yeah. I needed a new phone case because, not because every phone case I buy is bad, just because I am really hard on my cell phone. So, I needed another phone case. The service at uh, Best Buy is none of None of their scanning machines were working, so every barcode and stuff they had to key in by hand. Which And they had to key it in, then search for it. It didn't just pop up. So, it took four freaking ever in there, and it was hot on top of it. Like it's 60, it's not even 60 degrees here today. It's 59, 59, and it felt like it was 90 something degrees in Best Buy. I can forgive the malfunctioning equipment. That's not necessarily their fault, the people that work there. What I can't forgive is we're standing in line. On a busy Saturday. I Well, it, there wasn't that many people in line. But about four people deep. We stood there waiting for the person to check out the people in front of us for probably 10, 15 minutes and nobody opened another register. Yeah, I would one think, register. I would think especially with the situation that they're having where none of their barcodes are working, that means people are gonna have to wait even longer. So you wanna have more lines open than just one. And there were there were workers standing around and talking like out you know on the floor and i really think if just one more person would have opened the register it would have been a lot quicker the girl that oh that finally did open the register was really nice yeah yeah the other guy on the register seemed like he would have rather been anywhere but there yeah yeah so thanks hoover best buy for living up to how we've always felt about you and yes. Whatever. And but we, guys. We've complained multiple times. Yeah, we really have. I've sent strongly worded emails um, two times now. Um, but I got my new phone case. You guys want to see? Yeah, it's pretty. It's glitter. Green or green. 
silver glitter and then the rubber pieces are navy so i like it it's cute hi guys hi guys hopefully your day is going totes awesome yeah because ours is for the <laughs> most part it's kind of rainy and dreary outside but we did do some chopping a little bit of chopping but we found something at the grocery store that was on 25 percent off and so we bought it so we're gonna we're doing a piecemeal haul here so we're yeah. showing you one piece at a time yeah so we got this little pumpkin he's cute and purple is my favorite color so i know pumpkins are typically orange but not when you love purple and there's an option for purple pumpkins are purple so it's got this little like lighted hat or carved out metal hat thing and it lights up yeah you guys so it's gonna get dark ready freddy spaghetti and look guys it changes colors how fun does a little light show on the ceiling yay <laughs> that's my witch impression you're welcome but look <laughs> how fun you guys it's a glass jack-o-lantern and we spent four dollars on it guys four dollars so, and then we didn't show you this little, we don't know if we're going to have trick-or-treaters or not, but we got this little, like, candy tote thing, and I'm just saying if we don't have trick-or-treaters, we'll use this for something else, because I think it's real cute. <laughs> but, so we got this at Target last night, we forgot to show it to you. Hi guys, so we are on our way to... Panera to meet with our meetup group. We're leaving a little bit early because we want to eat before the people get there. We'll be back with you guys later. Hi guys! Welcome to the We Got Up Late and we need to do our hair. I'm still in my pajamas. Me too. But we're making macaroni and cheese for lunch. Um, mainly we have to be somewhere this afternoon, so we're going to make this for lunch, and then when we come home later, we'll eat it for dinner too. So, um, Brian's helping me today. This is all we've, this is what we've done already. Brian's my sous chef. He's been helping me prep because this one has a lot of steps to it. But, um, so we're doing that. Uh, so far this is, we've boiled noodles and then this is cream, milk, butter, and flour, and dry mush, I was going to say dry mushrooms, but I meant dry mustard, and then a little bit of salt and pepper to taste, and then we're going to put cheddar cheese in there, cheddar cheese soup, um, some Parmesan cheese which we haven't gotten out yet, and then we're going to add it to the noodles. The noodles in the pan and then top it with the remaining of the cheddar cheese and bake it for I want to say for like 20 minutes all right so some time has passed and things have happened not much time has passed it all happened real quickly so um, this is our cheese mixture mixed with our macaroni mixture and we're going to take this put it into that pan that is greased Top it with cheddar cheese and put it in an oven at 425 degrees for about 18 to 24 minutes. Yeah, and if you're wondering, uh, we'll put the recipe down in the description. If it's good. Yeah. If it's not good, we won't. But it looks amazing. <laughs> <laughs> but I need my sous chef. Okay, guys, so the macaroni and cheese is in the oven. Let's see if I can get a picture of it. It's in there. It's in there and it's cooking. Hopefully it's going to be delicious. Sorry, my hair is still a mess. Um, and can I say that I had the most awesome sauce love ever because he does, he helps me make a giant mess and then he cleans it up. I've always believed that the person who cooks should not also do the dishes. And he always helps with the dishes. And if I... If I don't move fast enough and she's already started to do the dishes before I can. Get all the crap I get, from him. I get upset. Yeah. So. But anyways, I just wanted to 
to tell them that how much I appreciate you. If you want to know where I get a lot of the stuff that I make, Pinterest. Follow me on Pinterest, which I think some of you are. But most of the times, the recipes that I make are in my Pinterest. And my either, if it's a slow cooker recipe, it's in a slow cooker category. Or like this mac and cheese is in my food category. But all that to say that we'll put it in the description if it turns out good. Guys. Ready to see this? It is finished. <laughs> oh my gosh. It looks Whoa. so good, you guys. Look. It's popping. Oh. So that needs to rest probably for About good ten minutes. five, ten minutes. Yeah. Before we're ready to dig in. So but look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Sorry. Oh, guys, he gets real intense about his mac and cheese. Guys. I'm telling you, I think you should be jealous. All right. So good. <laughs> it's so good. Okay, guys, Brian's about to try it. You guys should be jealous. <laughs> it was so good, you guys. It's so creamy. Yeah, that turned out really nice. I like that a lot. Hello. Hi, guys. Look at that snappy dresser, you guys. With his tie and stuff. Um, anyways, we're on a little bit of a, a little drive. We got it's a not as bad as yesterday fall day outside. It's not raining profusely. Hi guys. Hi. He took his tie off because he doesn't want to be fancy Brian anymore. Yeah, he, I want to be now he's, unfancy. Now he's sort of cash, but not really. Oh, look at this guy. It's see pretty. If we can, see if we can get the yeah, it'll There we go. Anyways, we're going into a store we have never ever been in yet today. <laughs> Well, we've never been into this Target. No, this, we well, have not. I've never been. I've not been Target. in it either. We're going to Target, y'all. But we got to make it snappy. Just a couple of little things that we uh, forgot at the store yesterday. So. And Starbucks. What? Is that me? I think it is. <laughs> bo, 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 bo. Hi, guys. Hello. So we went to Target and we really wanted Starbucks and there's a distinct lack of Starbucks in this car right now. It's not okay. Yeah, the uh, the line was extremely long and they had one person there. So we so were taking forever. We had to abort that mission. So we aborted that one. We're going to go to a, a, a different a stand -alone one. Yeah, one. just a standalone Starbucks. And you'll get points anyway. Yeah, plus we, we'll get our stars then. But, uh... That's probably it for us for today. It's, yeah. We've got some stuff to do when we get home. We uh, we realized early, uh, on our way out that we did not we had not filmed our video for tomorrow again. So we're gonna do that. Oops. So we're gonna as soon as we get home we'll be doing that, and then that's probably it. So. Yep. But we're we're gonna close that. Uh, we're gonna close the vlog out here. We'll catch you guys on the flip side. Flip, flip. But I just wanted to say that I love you. I love you. And we, we love, love you. you. Bye. Bye.